we're back at it everybody it is November 30th the morning and I got up into the shanty this morning there was actually eight deer out here in front of me when I got up here now there's only three the other ones went back into the woods it's really cold uh, kind of snowy morning so We'll see what happens. Hopefully we see some more deer. really coming down now I just spotted a deer that's bedded down in the woods up there. I saw its head move a few times. I don't know if you can see it right there, but it's bedded right under a hemlock tree. Looks like its head is down right now, maybe. I just seen it turn its head a while ago. I'm like, heck, that's a deer down in the woods. It's sleeping. They're not bedding too far from the food plot. That's probably only about 60 yards off the edge of the food plot where she's bed. Well, I'm out of coffee and we're out of deer. So we're going to pack up our stuff and we're going to head over to uh, Vern's place and check some trail cameras and probably do a little still hunting as I'm checking those cameras. It's actually going to be in Pennsylvania. So it's perfect snow for still hunting. I'm going to sneak through as quietly as I can and check those trail cameras. There's seven or eight cameras in there that I'd like to see kind of what's going on. So 
I gotta get a, our heating situation figured out at the house as well before Kaylee gets home so I don't get the, the, the scary side of Kaylee. We want the nice side, not the scary side. So we gotta make sure there's heat in the house. I don't know what's going on, but the heat isn't, isn't there. So that's probably number one on my to-do list before I ignore it and just hunt all day. <laughs> oh boy. We'll see you in a little bit. Okay, everybody, we're sneaking into this big lease in Pennsylvania. Got a nice real fresh layer of snow, probably three inches of real fresh snow. We're gonna be able to sneak really quietly and slowly. We got a bunch of trail cameras in here I'm gonna check. And I wanna keep an eye on the movement in here. I wanna see where the majority of these deer are, you know, passing through. And tomorrow morning I might come in here and hunt. So just gotta be aware of what's going on and where it's happening at. I do have a bear tag as well, so. You never know, there might be a bear in here. There's lots of pictures of bears in here all, all year long. sneaking through the woods and kept hearing what sounded like a cow elk and there are two porcupines up in this tree after I tracked them down making some weird noises making those noises maybe they're uh, maybe it's mating noises seems like a little cold to be getting your Willy Wonka out though boy those pine, pine trees are destroyed by them look at all the chewings on them you can see them in there they've been chewing the crap out of those trees We're gonna keep sneaking down through these pines. Well, we're getting near the end of our cameras here and batteries have been dead on a few of them because of the cold weather and we haven't checked them in over a month. But 
not really seeing the sign in here I was hoping I was going to see. That at first came really checked down by the creek. On the other side of the creek there was a lot of sign. Quite a few tracks. Up here, not so much. I want to keep going farther than I normally do. Closer to the edge of the property line on the back side and see what kind of signs back there. We'll get some new batteries in this camera right here. There's some cow tracks in here. This cow, there's a wild cow in this woods. I got pictures of them. I think at the beginning of October. First week of October, he was walking around in here and he's still walking around in here. I don't know if he's fair game or not. That'd be a heck of a lot better eating than a deer. It's a huge freaking cow. I thought it was a massive bear track at first, but then when he went through the water, you can see it's a perfect hoof print of a cow. I just saw two big doe I bumped to my right and that looks like one of their fawns is still standing up there. If that was a big buck, you'd be in trouble. Too big doe ran right up through here. Maybe there is a buck with him. We'll keep a close eye when we're sneaking up here. Those deer are bedded down in a treetop right here off the edge of the road. The road's right next to them. Two big doe and a fawn. We'll keep our eyes peeled. More jump up. 